we're back for another block train and I've got a face like a split watermelon. I'm so bloody excited about this one today. So this is what's called an overflow relief gully. When the drain is blocked downstream of a property, it overflows out of this gully here and mate, wow! Now gullies will have a water level, but the level should not be this high. Absolutely achieving nothing by doing that. But guys, behind the wall here, we got a block dunny and we've got a block bath. All right, what are we dealing with here? Whoa. Whoa. She is absolutely chock a block, mate. Well, there's that sneaky inspection cap to the toilet drain. We'll take this cap off here and this is where we're going to gain access to start jetting the drain clean. So don't look now. It's almost like a message in a bottle, but it's a message in a drain and they're probably wise words. Let's have a look. Got me plumber's chopsticks here and we'll pull this little cap out and do we, do we? Let's have a look. All right. Well, it's a bloody block drain, isn't it? I mean, what else did you think you were in for, guys? So whenever the client was flushing the drain, it would overflow out the gully. And as I say, right behind here, that's where the toilet is. And here's the toilet and we're working behind it. So let's fire the bloody jet up, guys. <laughs> I'll tell you what, I'm living the great Australian dream. You know, the sun is shining. Get over this here and, I mean, I can't complain. Life is bloody good. I'll move this out the way here. You know, driving around town, hopping from job to job, drain to drain, just living the dream. There's no better job on this planet. I mean, if there is, in the comments, let me know. But this is what I call bloody living. Anyway, I'm rambling. Let's get stuck in, guys. Let's unblock this drain. All right, we'll get set up here, and I'm going to send down my piercing nozzle to start the day off with, guys. We'll just puncture through the blockage, and then I'll get my turbo nozzle out and just go to town, mate. But, uh... I've got a very sneaky, sneaking suspicion that up that way we got tree roots. So we'll send it down and see what we can come up with, guys. And we are away, you little ripper! If the algorithm has just sent me your way, let me know. What were you watching when I popped up on your screen as a watch next video? Because I had an absolute cracker of a comment last week. A bloke all the way over in Costa Rica was telling me that he was watching a highlights of Mike Tyson's career and I've just popped up as an up next video, you know. How bloody good is that, you know. And I'm, I'm, I'm not saying I'm anything like Mike Tyson, you know. I don't hit women, I hit block drones. But whoa, here we go. This is what it's all about. I bloody live and breathe this stuff, guys. This is what you call living the dream. How lucky are we? Are we close to the blockage? I can hear the back. Bruce, Bruce, stop your bloody rambling, mate, and just unblock a drain, and I'm hearing you. Oh, shut me trap, and we'll clear this block drain. But, wow! We'll just turn it off for a second. Whoa, have we cleared it? No, we haven't bloody cleared it, have we? Let's go try and find the inspection shaft. We'll just take a stroll to the back of the property to try and find this inspection shaft. Shit. <laughs> I've just nearly walked into that spider's web and no thank you. I've walked into too many before, you know. Five minutes later, you're, you're feeling this itch on your backside and a spider's biting your bum. No thanks, mate. But anyway, down here somewhere, there should be an inspection shaft and it's it's probably under, under, under the dirt here somewhere. Bamboo and all sorts, mate. So... Yeah, without a drainage plan, we're probably not going to find that shaft. So anyway, back to the drawing board, or back to the drain. Whoa! Woohoo! I mean, surely we must be close now. Whoa! Whoa! Have we got it? Have we got it? Are the levels dropping? Are the levels dropping? No, they're not. Well, in a way, that's good news, because you know what that means? We've still got a drain to unblock. Let's keep going.
Have we got it? Wow! Yo -ho -ho! Bob is your mother's brother. Could be your brother's mother. I don't know, it's 2024, mate. But anyway, let's give her a test drive and see if she's nice and clear. And look at that. It's just a Picasso, a work of bloody art, mate. Stick you in here and oh, you can hear her sucking away like no one's business, mate. Look at that. It really is days like these when I pinch myself and I'm thinking, am I living a dream? Am I in a dream? Am I in a simulation? Or am I just having a bloody good day? Because it is a bloody good day, you know? You just can't complain. Although maybe I will complain because that still looks a little blocked. But that's okay because we were going to get the turbo nozzle down this drain anyway. Let's get stuck in. Let's give her a quick blast and then we'll get the camera out just to make sure she is Mickey Bloody Mouse, mate. We'll send the camera down and the number of comments I get just under my breath here, people saying they've had one of these cameras up their bum to check a few things out. Oh, I probably shouldn't. Bloody family show, isn't it? Oh yes, you at the back again. Bruce, Bruce, why you got old footage? I can see it says 2023 on the screen and it's 2024. And yes, mate, I know it's 2024, but the, for some reason the camera likes to go back in time and I can't set the date right, mate, all right? Anywho, enough about the dates, and let's have a look at the dra There we go, we got some more roots, guys. All right, well, we'll send the jet up, or back downstream, and we'll we'll just blast the living daylights out of there, mate, but go a bit further downstream and make sure there's nothing else lurking inside the drain. And you guys know the drill by now. In the bloody comments, let me know where on earth you're from. You know, literally, where on this earth are you from? We're all inside this drain together, except we're from different parts of the planet. Mind bloody blowing, mate. All right, let's have another inspection of this drain and make sure it's nice and Mickey Mouse squeaky clean, mate. And, uh... I mean, it looks amazing, doesn't it? It almost looks so good that I could probably, I don't know, give the drain a kiss of approval. Is that such a thing? Could it be a thing? Maybe I'm starting a new thing, you know? Letting the customer know that I've given the drain a nice smooch and it's ready to go. Which is clean as clean can be. Be a real guarantee, wouldn't it? But anyway, I'm absolutely rambling. Never mind me. But seriously, it's got a good ring to it. On an advert, you know? Bruce, he'll give it a smooch of approval. Well, until next time, we'll cover this up. But can you imagine, you know, some plumber turns up next time and says, don't look now. And he's like, well, better bloody take off. Yeah, I'll pack up and we'll get out of here. It says, don't look now. Serious note, though, there's bloody corn everywhere. Why is there always corn? Always. And of course it's clean-up time. I mean, can you imagine we were to pack up, drive off, the owner comes out the back, you see sewerage all over the place. And yeah, he may think, oh, well, you know, the plumber didn't clean it up. It wasn't his job. But, you know, he's going to walk out now and he's going to be like, the plumber's cleaned up. It wasn't his job, but he's bloody cleaned up. What an absolute legend. I'm going to tell my friends about him. I'm going to tell my family about him. That's how you get referrals, guys, you know. Just 110% every time. Mm -hmm.